<coughs> hey guys, what up? So today I'm going to do a French braid tutorial. Oh, well, how to French braid. Bonjour. No, I don't know why it's called a French braid. I'm just assuming someone who is France. They created this French braid. So this is really easy. Once you get the hang of it, you can do it in like three minutes, two minutes. Well, it depends on your hair length and thickness and all that, but whatever. So basically, you can do this with knotty hair. It's way easier if you brush out your hair. So get that magical brush or a comb. You there's so much hair in here. Anyway, so get like a brush or a comb, whatever you brush your hair with. Just make sure there's no knots in it. I like wearing this to the beach. Let's go to the beach, beach. No, I like wearing this to the beach. Because it's just all the hair is out of your face and just reminds me more of a beachy thing. So just make sure there's like no knots in here. And now I'm going to start because this is a pretty long show. So I'm just going to flip around so it's easier for you guys to see. And I'm going to flip all my hair to the back. But first because I have shorter bangs, I bobby pin them and then I'll French braid. You can choose to leave pieces out or whatever you like. So I'll just brush it all to the back. I love brushing. And let's get started. So for this, since I like to pin it up and I don't like the braid right like at the top, I go from my eyebrows around and that's the hair that I start with. And it doesn't need to be perfect. So this hair that you have in your hand you're going to split it into three sections. One. And here's two and three. So, it's just like a, a normal braid, but with a twist. And if you don't know how to regularly braid, then you need to do that. So, we're going to put this side in the middle, this one in the middle, just like a normal braid. But now, I'm going to get this piece would normally go in the middle. And first, before I put it in the middle, I'm going to grab some hair. And of course, you're not going to grab hair from the complete opposite side, because then your brain would just be wet. <laughs> so anyway, now you just put it into the middle. And then this strand, you're going to grab some hair first, and then put it in the middle. And it's just like a pattern, you just repeat it. So the strands would normally go in the middle, so first I'm going to grab some hair, and now I'm going to put it in the middle, and just so on, so on, so grab some hair here, put it in the middle, just keep doing this until you're out of hair, which I almost am, Oof. sometimes happens with a lot of one, and I'll just grab off a little bit of hair, and so once you know my hair, some people will actually just hair tie right here, but I like to continue to braid it. Now, if this is getting uncomfortable for you, just move your hand position so they're at the front. My hair is short enough, then I can still braid it. Now. Get your hair tie, you can get the little elastic ones where they're like invisible or the same hair color. I'm against the big black one. Make sure it's tight. <laughs> now this is what it looks like. It just looks like the braid is kind of sewn into your head. Yes, is that the right word to use it? That's kind of what the French braid reminds me of. That's just kind of what it looks like to me. Turn back around. Okay, so this is what it looks like. From the back, it's kind of more fancy and sophisticated. And if, I just like to sometimes, if your hair's long enough, just flip the braid in front, and it's just more like, yeah. And I just put my glasses on. Sophisticated, but I like this is more my way, and I just pin my bangs up, and it works perfectly, and it looks super cute, and you can basically wear it anywhere, especially it's good for summer, 
because it's just out of your face. It's just out of your face and just nice and easy. And yeah, I hope that I helped you guys. And remember, don't give up. Just keep practicing, keep trying. And if you can't do it on yourself, try doing it on other people first. Bye.